This is an APAC Studio presentation. APAC. 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 Almost professional amateur comic. Rabbit funny. Rabbit funny. F- r- funny rabbit. Uh. Rabbit funny. Yeah. Faulty door handle sabotages Putin's inspection of military equipment. An effort to show off the superiority of Russian military equipment backfired recently when the door handle of a Jeep fell off just as Russian President Vladimir Putin was inspecting the vehicle. Oopsie! The Kremlin leader was being shown an array of military vehicles parked outside his residence in the southern resort of Sochi, including a Russian-made UAZ Patriot pickup truck equipped with heavy machine guns. Sounds awesome. When Putin tried to open the front passenger side door, it would not budge. (coughs) Lieutenant General Alexander Shevchenko, part of the military delegation showing off the equipment, came to Putin's aid, but when he grabbed the door handle, it came away in his hand. (coughs) Putin let out a chuckle as Shevchenko hurriedly dropped the handle into the pickup through an open window. The Russian leader then moved on to inspect some other vehicles, but did not attempt to get inside any of them. Probably just didn't want to sit down and, you know, wrinkle his suit. A video of the incident was posted on the Russian news site Life News. The incident will revive uncomfortable memories of the kind of shoddy workmanship which long dogged the reputation of Russia's auto industry. Manufacturers say their vehicles are now much better. But for years, buyers of new Russian cars would routinely face lumpy paintwork, engines that would not start, and cheaply built interiors that fell apart. Sounds a lot like GM vehicles pre-2009 government bailout. Putin himself has been left red-faced before while attempting to promote the Russian auto industry. In 2011, he climbed into a new Lada Granada saloon car and failed to start the engine at least five times. The Lada Granada saloon car wouldn't start? Saloon car? Well, maybe it was drunk. Okay, stop that. Reports of the event also said he needed help from car-making executives to open the car's trunk. Putin had spent a few days in Sochi meeting officials involved in the Russian arms industry. The sector had been riding high after the Kremlin's military campaign in Syria showed off the capability of the Russian weapons to potential buyers around the world. My APAC take on this is... Really, Russian Federation, your arms industry has been riding on a high after your actions in Syria? Who do you think you are by using a war as a promotional tool? The United States? Great Britain? France? The former Soviet Union? The United States? Oh, the nerve. This has been a presentation from Tim Morgan's APAC Studio. For more almost professional amateur comic studio content, visit the APAC YouTube channel. Search APAC 2002. That's A-P-A-C 2002 on YouTube.